Hi, my name is Michael Novello from visualpix.com. Welcome to 5 Minutes Photoshop. Here I present you fast and effective Photoshop effects and techniques in 5 minutes or less. The Instagram effect I show you right now, it's called the Gotham effect. And for this we need at first a frame and a vignetting. And for this I'm going to add a solid color here, solid color layer with black. And then I'm going to add a rectangle, a rounded rectangle in this case. And I'm dragging it like this. Let's get it like that. Okay. One with filling of white and a radius of 50 pixels for the for this roundness here. Okay. <coughs> now I need to have a mm, little bit of a vignetting here in the corners. For this I'm going to s set a blending option, inner glow, and I set the blend mode to normal and crank up the size a little bit, something like that, and the range about 50% or so. And I click OK. Then I'm going to Alt click and drag my image above the frame and set this to a clipping mask so that this clips with the white rectangle. And now I'm going to desaturate this image by clicking on the black and white adjustment layer and then I need a curve adjustment layer. I'm going to the blue and I click in the middle to have an anchor point and I'm dragging here in the dark parts I'm going upwards around the middle of this vertical line here and here as well I'm pulling that down about to the middle and then I set this layer to a hard light blend mode so we have this hard shadow is this really cool looking heavy looking look here and next step is to copy the image layer here duplicate layer okay and with this selected i'm going to add a filter a blur filter a motion blur and with the settings of between 230 and 260 and the angle of zero i click okay and I set this to screen. So we have uh, some light, light leaks here, but this is too strong. We're going to lower this down to about yeah, 48% or so. It depends always on the image. And the last step is to add a little bit of noise to the image. And I'm going with 14, 15% or so with a uniform distribution and monochromatic and click OK. And there we are. Now we have this strong Gotham effect here. Maybe we can lower the, the motion blur a little bit so that it's not too strong. And there we are. So this is the before and this is the after. Thank you for watching my videos. Um, if you like my videos, you can subscribe to my channel right here in the middle. And my last two videos you can find here and here. And if you really like my videos, you can support me on patreon.com. Here's the link. And thanks again. And see you next time. Bye.